Hello and welcome to this Power BI tutorial with me, James from Matador Software. Today we're going to be looking at how we can use the top end function in DAX, calculate within DAX, and some conditional formatting to dynamically highlight our top overspenders and have different colors represented within our chart. So the first thing we need to look at the data, very simple, by location, we've got a spend, an actual spend, a budget and the difference. I use Power Query and absolute values for the budget difference. There's no plus or minus. We just want to see to the extent how far we're off of our budget. So to do this, we need three DAX elements. We need to create an expression. So we can just sum the budget difference because that's what we're looking at within our Power BI chart. So we're looking at the sum of the budget difference. And that's going to create an expression that we can easily use within our top three overspenders nested calculate function. So here we are saying, and feel free to screen grab this, this code, the stacks code, we're saying calculate the total budget difference. And we want to find out the top end, the top three overspenders by location and the total budget difference in descending order. And then we can take the values by location. So really logical flow, nested calculate function allows us to change the filter context and get those top three offenders. And that's gonna help us dynamically highlight those and really help people make data-driven decisions in an instant, as we like to say. Now we can fact check this. We can check the, the top three overspenders by dragging it into the table here, taking the location as well, and you can see this is presented correctly as per the budget difference that we see within our chart here. So we can see Paris, Calgary and Milan correctly represented as the top three overspenders. Now, what else do we need to do? Well, lastly, um, for our conditional formatting, we're gonna need one more DAX measure. Simple if function that will say, if the location spend is those top three overspenders, color them as red. If not, we want to see their data values represented as white. So how do we do that? Well, we need to go into the data colors within formatting. I'm using the old formatting pane here. But instead of just selecting that yellow, we go into conditional formatting and we want to format it as a field value and select the top end color. That's that if function that is then controlling the top three overspenders. And there we go. We select that. Pretty simple case here. It looks great, catches the eye. We can see those, those um, key metrics that stand out, investigate, make decisions. And yeah, really nice work around using some creative DAX. As usual, if you like the content, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Thank you.